Hello, good evening, everyone. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Carlos, good evening, evening, teacher. Julio, good evening, Ana Veronica. How good are evening. you guys? How are you guys? I'm so happy. Happy because it's Friday. <laughs> yes. Hi, <laughs> sister. Uh, yeah, it's true. Finally, right? Yes. Mr. Rodrigo, welcome to Mr. Hello. No lo había visto por ahí. I'm sorry, Mr. Welcome yeah. also, Ana Veronica. Welcome, Miss. Give me one second because, wait, I have a little problem with my internet at the beginning. So, a second. <laughs> so, we can. T-shirt, T-shirt. I send you my sentence. Yes, I was Mr. Up I'm sorry, yes, mister, I have a lot of messages right now. Okay. Um, wait, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say, uh, see it right now. Give me one second. Oh, here. Uh, so it will be, they are nervous. Le faltó el subject en las dos primeras. Uh, en las dos primeras, I am nervous. Um, uh, you are nervous, maybe? You are nervous, mister, about playing soccer? It could be. Or in the other one, I am sad about going, going to a new job, maybe. I am sad, it could be. We are proud of winning. So, it's good, está bien. Solo que en las, dos primer, las tres primeras nos faltó un subject. Y las demás, yeah, they're good. Las demás sí están good. Mister, I cannot hear you. No lo escucho, mister. I'm sorry. Okay. I take off my microphone. Oh, okay. So, yeah, you, you do understand that one? Sí, sí me entiende. ¿Cuál es lo que faltó las tres primeras? Sí, el, 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 el I, el uh, I am, y, y el, el, ¿cómo se llama? El pronombre. Okay, yes, exact. En las tres primeras nada más, en las demás están, they are good, okay? Okay. Okay, perfect. Thank you, Mr. Thank you. No problem, mister. I'm sorry that I take a little bit. Sorry que, que me tardé en contestarle, but I was, I was okay. like running right now. No, no hay problema. Yo las envié tarde también. <laughs> <laughs> Era la venganza. Ah, yeah. No, no, I, uh, I am not a reverse person. Hello, Mr. Carlos. I have a little bit. Hello, Hello teacher. Hello, good evening, mister. How are you? How are you, mister? Nice. Nice. Welcome also, Carmen. Welcome, Julio. Welcome. Hello. Good evening. Let's wait. Oh, no, it's time already. I was a little bit late, one minute late. Sorry for that. I was having trouble with, with Zoom. It didn't open for me. <laughs> but we are here, and that's good, right? So today we are going to continue, okay, with today's class. And today, wait, hmm, what is happening with Zoom? Okay, so good evening, one more time. We are going to continue and start today's class. That is Friday, is November 25th, 2022. We are going to continue with English for work program basic module number three, right? And my name, one more time, is Lisa Rosemary Alvarado Martinez, and we are going to start. And today we are going to finish with unit number one, company identity, right? That is very important. And uh, because we have been talking about the mission, the vision, the values, right? And about some important things in a company, right? Hemos estado hablando de todas las cosas muy importantes en una, en una compañía, que es como la organización de cada cosa. Eh, de, de una compañía como los valores, las, los, las diferentes jerkies, right? La vision and la mission. And today we are going to do a little bit of a review of all of that. And also we are going to do a review of the grammar topics that we have been studying. El día de ahora vamos a hacer un pequeño repaso de, de, pues de las, eh, los temas gramaticales y el vocabulario que hemos estado estudiando, right? Uh, and 
um, to start. Yesterday we were talking about the values, right? And you were saying some important values about each company, right? Y ustedes estaban diciendo algunos valores que son muy importantes y que deberían de existir en algunas compañías, ¿verdad? And so, what are we going to do? Um, I'm going to share with you a link. Le voy a compartir un link en el cual ustedes van a poder compartir los valores que ustedes estaban mencionando el día de ayer. So you have to write and type the value that is very important. Van a digitar ahí el value que ustedes creen que es esencial en una company. En este link que les voy a enviar. Okay? Y después yo voy a compartir todo lo que ustedes me compartan. Ok. Yo lo voy a presentar, sorry. So, there you have it. Ahí lo pueden, este, pues, darle clic en el, en el chat, de, en el chat box de, de Zoom. So, um, so, please write the core values that you remember from yesterday. Remember, like, for example, we had uh, helping others, honesty, respect. Todos los valores que ustedes creen que son importantes en una company. Welcome, Rebecca. Welcome, Christian. And uh, so, yes, okay. So, let's do it, please. Hello. Hello. Mentimeter, mentimeter. Yes. Is the is it is lime lime mirrors. <laughs> you like it? <laughs> no, like this. Uh -huh. It's a liar. No. Sí, sí, es de mentira. <laughs> es de mentira. Mentimeter. No. <laughs> mentimeter. No. No. <laughs> No, es que mide, es que también se puede utilizar para otras situaciones. So, mide, like, the different answers. Mide las diferentes respuestas. Entonces, ahorita vamos a medir cuántas respuestas yo tengo de ustedes. So, yes. Ok. <laughs> yes. Ok, so let's do it. I'm waiting. Oh, wow. Thank you. But I only have two people. Solo tengo dos personas que me están compartiendo este, eh, values. I want more people. What about the other ones? Where are you? Only two people I have. Look. Ya las ingresé, teacher. Oh, thank you, Mr. What about the other ones? Porque ahí solo tengo. Porque una vez enviada solo dice thank you, thank you for your participation, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Ya yes. significa que ya fueron enviadas. Yes. Ok. Okay, I have another person here that has participated, but what about the other ones? And recuerden en el chat box is the link. Le damos click y ahí pues podemos empezar a compartir, right? Oh, four people now. Very good, thank you. Okay, so these are the answers that you have so far. And we have here mutual uh, commitment, it says service to other, resilience, honesty, responsibility, efficiency, empathy, empathy, yes, punctuality, loyalty, integri integrity, respect, innovation, resilience, punctuality, right? Yeah, yesterday we were talking about this, and it's all the values, right? Are 
so important. Core values, obviously, it would be about the things that they have to be in the main of the, the company, right? Recuerden que cuando hablamos de core values, este, pues estamos hablando de cosas, de valores que deben de estar muy presentes, okay? And in the, in the like this and like the, the company, right? Uh, so we have uh, what else? Excellence, uh huh. Excellence, uh, empathy, responsibility, right? Yeah. Wow. Very good. I have seven, uh, seven that people that have shared so far. Okay, very good. Thank you everybody for sharing your ideas. That was awesome because you give your ideas about the um, the values that for you are important, right? Now let's go ahead and continue with the next activity. In the next activity that I have for you, okay, it's called a speak up. Why it's called a speak up? Uh, it's a word shame because I'm gonna share with you a, a letter, okay? En esa próxima actividad, pues van a ver ciertas letras y ustedes van a compartir, ok, una palabra con la letra que vean por ahí. Todos vamos a tener un tiempo para participar. No sé si Miss Carmen Guadalupe, are you oyente? Yes or no, porque a veces veo que tienen oyente y no. Yes, teacher. Ok, ok, no problem. And you, Ana Verónica, are you oyente or no? Or are you participating? Or si estás participando? No, le escucho mi. Sorry. Hola, perdón. Es en el trabajo, le digo. Eh, oh. Dejé un chat por ahí, un mensaje por chat ahí. Entonces me ha tocado quedarme. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Ok, ok, no problemis. Solo para no saber, porque le puede llamar, le estoy llamando y a veces no me contestan. So, para así saber, ok, no problemis. Thank you for sharing. Okay, so this game, as I told you before, eh, I'm gonna call some of you. Voy a llamar a los que, eh, algunos de ustedes y le voy a decir una letra. Por ejemplo, vamos a estar, vamos a empezar with eh, Mr. Rodrigo. Tell me a word with the letter E. Dígame una palabra con la letra E. Elephant. Oh, very good. Thank you. Let's go next one. Carlos Argueta, tell me a word with the letter Q. Q, 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 Carlos Argueta. Quiz. I'm sorry? Quiz. Oh, yes, very good. Thank you, mister. Let's go next one. Help me, Miss Rebecca, a word with the letter D. Dolphin. Dolphin. Excellent, Miss. Thank you. Let's go. Mr. Carlos Miguel, tell me a word with the letter S. Server. Server. Excellent. Thank you. Let's go. Next one. Mr. Nilton. Welcome, Mr. Tell me a word with the letter M. Nilton, are you there? Are you here? Sorry, teacher. Uh, meeting. I'm meeting. sorry? Meeting. 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 Yeah, yeah. Oh, perfect, mister. Thank you. Let's go. Next one. Christian, tell me a word with the letter. V. Uh, no, teacher. Yes, Mr. Christian, with the letter V. Mm. B, B, B. Mm -hmm. me ocurre en ahorita ninguna. <laughs> uh, can you hear? Oh, very good. Miss Ana Verónica says vacation, mister. 
Vacation. Ah, uh, yes. Yes, yes, but no problem. <laughs> Very okay. good. Thank, Thank you, Miss Ana Veronica. Let's go next one. We are going to go with Miss Madeline. Tell me a word with the letter M. Miss Marley Oneida? No, teacher. Now? No. Now? No. Yes, no. excellent. Thank you. Let's go with the letter. Miss Clelia, hello, Miss. Tell me a word with the letter W. Uh, that word. I'm sorry? Uh, uh, where? Work. Uh, work. Ah, uh, yes, that's work. work. Let's go. Next one. Karen and Stefania, tell me a word with the letter. Oh. Um, other? Other. Yes. Perfect. Thank you, Miss Karen. Let's go with next one. David and Manuel. Hello. Tell me a word with the letter F, mister. Mm, found. I'm sorry? Found. Found, excellent, thank you. Let's go, next one. Dennis, tell me a word with the letter I. I. Mm -hmm. Do you consider a verb? Yes, please. No, no, any word, Miss. Cualquier palabra, Miss. Solo quiero que sea una palabra with the letter I. I are all. No se me ocurre ninguna. I. I'm sorry? I, 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 with the letter I. No, no se me ocurre. Ice cream. Ice, Ice cream. cream. Yeah. <laughs> that was it. Very good, Miss. But thank you. Don't worry. That's okay. Let's go, Julio. Mr. Julio, tell me a word with the letter Y. Yellow. Excellent. Okay, now let's see. Vamos a ver. Volunteers, let's see. Tell me a word with the letter P. Volunteers, one, two, three. Pacific. Pacific. Potatoes. Potato. Oh. I'm sorry? Plant. Yes, very good. Excellent. Let's go next one. Let's go. Volunteer with the letter R. Wrong. Right. Remote. <laughs> Both. Red. Oh, very good. Red. Excellent. Thank you. Remember. <laughs> Re remember exactly. Revelish. Radish, uh -huh. With the letter C, word. Cook. Cook. Oh, right. Change, change, change. Change, uh huh. Car. Cheese. Cup. Cup. Cake. Cake. Cup. Cupcake, mm -hmm. right? Chocolate. Uh, Chocolate, yeah. Let's do one more, and that's the last one. Tell me a word with the letter H. Oh, hello. Aha, uh -huh, hello. Pose. Uh -huh. Aham. Up. I. Home. Horse. Horse, yes. Horse, hello. 
happy. Yes, very good. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you. Wow. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Hello, right? Excellent. Thank you, everybody, for participating and doing. That was just to practice a little bit of, of uh, the vocabulary in, in general, right? But that was super good. Y con now, X, teacher. X, a saxophone. Okay. Okay. The saxophone is like marimba. Okay. And okay. we also have, uh, wait, there's an ad, other word, but wait, uh, X ray. X ray. Uh -huh. X ray, X. Wait, I don't remember the other ones. But those are the most common ones, okay? The, those are very used, okay? Uh, so now, ahora. I do remember, como ustedes se recuerdan, last uh, yesterday, I left you the verbs, le dejé los verbos y una tareita, okay? What was the homework? What was the homework? Who? Who? Cuando? When? <laughs> when? <laughs> when? What? It was yesterday. Les dije que se tenían que aprender cinco verbos en las tres formas y le volví a mandar eh, el, el, la lista ¿verdad? para que se las aprendieran. Porque, pues, son muy importantes, como les decía, para los temas, para sí. el tema que estuvimos estudiando ayer y el de ahora. ¿verdad? Bueno, y los próximos, ¿ok? And so, do you learn it? Yes, you learned teacher. it? Okay, vamos a practicarlos ahorita. Uh, give me one second. Y vieron el video que les mandé. Huh. Did you watch it? ¿Qué verbo se les quedó del video? Quiero que me digan uno de los, del video. <laughs> Dígame, Miss Jenny. It. Ajá, ¿y cuál es el otro? Ahí decía. Ajá, Dígame, yo me lo sé el video, ya casi que me lo aprendo todo, ajá. ¿eh? Sí, le escuché, pero como era muy rockero, no se me quedó. Era muy rock, muy rap. Muy rap. It, it, eaten. No, it, ain't eaten. Stuck, stuck, stuck. Eh, así, ¿verdad? Quienes lo vieron ya saben que es como rap. Ese es un teacher in, in the United States que así enseña los verbos. I wish, yo quisiera va a cantar así, pero no puedo. <laughs> so, um, eh, for example, Karen, do you, who learned the, no, para todos mejor. Vamos a hacer una general. ¿Quiénes se aprenden unos verbos de verdad? De verdad, like true, 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 that you learned the verbs. Tell me, me, miss. Okay, Rodrigo. Okay, tell me, Rodrigo, three verbs that you remember. Okay, mm -hmm. make, med, med, uh -huh. take, talk, talking. Ah, take, to taken. Yes. Okay, perfect. Yes. Very good. Write, wrote, written. Oh, wow. <laughs> do, you, do you know another one? Uh, B was being. Aha, uh -huh. oh, what? Oh my goodness, amazing, mister. Thank you for doing it. Awesome. Oh, sorry. Next one, next volunteer. <coughs> no problem, Nilton. Thank you. Well, let me know. Alguien más que se haya aprendido los verbos. Raise your hand. Los verbs. Okay, thank you, Miss Rebecca. Tell me. Uh, be. Mm -hmm. That's where being. Aha. Uh -huh. um, eat. A, uh -huh. eat, eating. Yes. Um, go. Uh -huh. When. Yes. Born. Yes, very good. Uh -huh. um, fine. Uh -huh. Fair. Uh -huh. Fair. Fair. Mm -hmm. It's One. fine, fine, found, found. Find, ah, find. Find. Mm -hmm. found. Uh -huh. find, found, found. Uh -huh. And get, uh -huh. got a gift. A get, no, get, got, got, got them. Get, got, got, got them. Mm -hmm. 
Más o menos. No, but that's good, Miss. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you for doing the homework. Vamos a ver, ¿alguien más? Okay, Carlos, tell me what verbs. Uh, um, go, uh -huh. went, uh -huh. gone, uh -huh. make, uh -huh. made, uh -huh. made. Yes. Uh, read, read, read. No, read, read, read. Como el no, color read. después. Ah, uh -huh. Se escribe igual, pero se dice como el color, ¿ok? Uh, read. Uh -huh. read, 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 red, red, red. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh, take, took, taken. Ajá. Uh -huh. Four and. Um, write, wrote, writing. Written. Written. Perfect. Yes. Excellent. Or... <laughs> Don't worry, Mister. Don't worry. Don't worry. She's learning. Perfect. Don't worry. Ajá. Uh -huh. No hay problema, Mister. Don't worry. Okay, también se los está aprendiendo, ya vio. <laughs> Estaba diciendo written también. Ajá, uh -huh, somebody else that learned. No, that's perfect. Que aprenda repitiendo, mister. <laughs> es un oyente. Yeah, no problem, mister. Don't, I, don't, I don't get mad. No, no me molesta, that's perfect. <laughs> Así aprenden los niños escuchando. Háblenles en English. If you have any kids, háblenles en English. Digan, hello, baby. Hello, eh, sweetheart. Ok, para que vayan aprendiendo palabritas también. Y así we can change El Salvador for English. Ok, we can be bilingual, everybody. <laughs> yeah, that would be cool. Eso sería súper genial que todos pudiéramos ser bilinguals. Vamos a ver, ahorita vamos a pasar asistencia because it's already time. Ok, so please stay presente. Adriana Gabriela. Ale, Ana Marleni. Presente. Thank you. Blanca Luz. Ana Luz. Uh, me, Blanca Luz. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, Carlos Miguel. Present teacher. Thank you. Carlos Roberto. Present teacher. Thank you. Christian Alexander. Hello, teacher. Thank you. Eh, Claudia María. I saw Claudia. Claudia, Claudia. Bueno, la vi, pero ya no. Ok. And Clelia Estela. Present. Thank you. David Emanuel. Present, teacher. Thank you. Diana Noemi. Edwin Roberto. Jenny Carolina. Present, teacher. Thank you. Jorge Luis. Julio César. Present. Thank you. Jose Dimas. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Karen Estefanía. Present teacher. Thank you. Nilton Alexander. No sé si ya regresó Mr. Nilton. Ahí está, pero no está. Ok. Um, Rodrigo José. Present teacher. Thank you. Ruth Rebecca. Present teacher. Thank you. Serafín. María Yamilet. Present. Thank you. Carmen Guadalupe. Present teacher. Thank you. Ana Verónica. Present. Thank you. Marlene Oneida. Present. Thank you. Juan Ezequiel. Ok, thank you everybody for being here. Gracias a todos. Present. Oh, thank you, Nilton. Acabo de mencionarlo. Wait, mister. Wait, wait, wait. Aquí lo vamos a manejar. Thank you, mister. Ok, okay. <laughs> thank you. Ok, so thank you for being here. Gracias a todos por estar aquí. I know that sometimes it's a little bit difficult. Yo sé que a veces es muy difícil. But please let me know. Por favor, avísenme si van a estar de oyentes. Aunque ya estemos en la clase y yo veo ahí en la clase el mensaje, pues lo voy a ver, ok? So please eh, send me if you are oyente or if you are not going to come. Si no van a venir, también avísenme, ok? Este, para, uh, pues, porque recuerden, vea, sí, no problem, María Yamilet, este, para así pues estar pendiente de ustedes, porque recuerden que es muy importante que asistan a todas las sesiones, ok, pero yo sé que a veces, pues, por fuerza de, de, que son, 
de nuestro alcance, pues no están a nuestro alcance, pues es difícil, ok, so let me know, ok, pues me avisan. Um, ok, no problem, María Emilet. En la segunda, pues nos vamos, ahí le vamos a, a poner check. Hello, Mr. Dimas, welcome. Ahorita vamos a pasar lista para Mr. Dimas. Hello, Hello, José Dimas. Estamos pasando asistencia, Mr. Ahorita. <laughs> Present, ¿verdad? Thank you, Mr. for being here. Gracias por venir. Okay, so let's continue. And now, yesterday at, uh, we were talking at the end of the class about the core values, right? Estamos hablando al final de la clase acerca de los de los core values, de los values in a company, right? And efficiency, innovation, respect, punctuality, service to others, integrity, loyalty, and responsibility were one, one of the most common values in a company, right? Esos son como algunos de los más comunes en algunas compañías, ¿verdad? Y te, ustedes decían otro, ¿verdad? And you send them in the chat. That was perfect. And thank you for, for giving your ideas. Gracias a todos por dar sus ideas. But we missed one section, pero nos faltó una sección y ahorita la vamos a hacer, okay? And in that section, you were supposed to give your idea, okay, uh, about you, okay? What values do you put into practice in your company? Que de acerca de qué valores de los que les estaba mostrando ayer ustedes ponen en práctica en su compañía. Okay. So right now, give me one second, okay? Que quiero, I want to check something. Wait a second. Hmm. Wait, wait. So before, wait. Okay, so here we have, here we have, it says, uh, so you already give me yesterday, you shared some of the three personal, well, yesterday, what about, what's about the company, right? Ayer si se dieron cuenta, pues eran acerca de los valores de la compañía. Ustedes me estaban compartiendo acerca de la, de la compañía de que, ¿Cuáles eran esos, eran esos values? Very important values. But right now, I have a question for you. And the question is, what are the three personal, personal values that you transfer to your interactions with your core workers? Okay. ¿Cuáles son los tres valores? Okay. Three values que ustedes comparten con sus core workers. In my case, I am going to explain with the class. Okay. Yo voy a expresar mis values con ustedes. I think for me, uh, my three values with you, it's responsibility. I try to be responsible. I always try to help others. Yo trato de ayudarlos, okay? And responsibility is all the one. And the last one, it would be that it would be, mm, oh my goodness, innovation. I try to be inno uh, innovative. Ok, with the classes, ok, trato de traerles algo nuevo cada semana, bueno, bueno, ya van a ver cada semana porque ya tengo las clases de la otra semana, that's why, and something new, ok, so we can learn para que podamos aprender como pudieron ver con las, las platforms, me gusta utilizar nuevas platforms para que ustedes también las utilicen en su daily life, ok, so uh, that would be for me, eso serían para mí. You, volunteers, voluntarios que quieran compartir tres values que ustedes comparten con sus compañeros de trabajo, ok. Volunteers, raise your hand, raise your hand. Oh, Rodrigo, tell me, mister, ya lo vi que activé el micrófono. Tell me, mister, I want to know. Ok, ok. Tell me. Uh, my three values with my work team are number one, respect. Mm -hmm. Number two, mm -hmm. integrity. Ah, ok. Number three, responsibility. Oh. Number four, effic efficiency. Efficiency. Uh -huh. Efficiency. Uh -huh. And number five, mm -hmm. innovation. Nice, mister. Thank you for sharing. Those are super good values. Not all the people have them. Thank you for sharing. Give me one second because I want to write it. Quiero escribirlo, mister. Just give me one second because me está cargando aquí like, like the whiteboard. Give me a second. 
Okay, so you say, well, if values, personal values, van a ser estos, personal. Porque recuerden que hay todo tipo de values, ¿verdad? Values with other people, values with family, values for co-workers, okay? So, mention number one, please, mister. Only number one. Of Solo course. I'm It sorry? Respect, respect. Respect, excellent. Thank you, mister. Very, very good. Okay, tell me another volunteer. Raise your hand. Vamos a ver the next one that wants to share another person. Thank you, Carlos. Tell me. Uh, uh, respect. Honesty. Mm, okay, honesty. Uh -huh. Punctuality. Punctuality. Uh -huh. What Empathy. else? Empathy. Oh, nice. Empathy. That's Good, Mr. Uh, empathy, it's very good as well. Not everybody has it. No todas las personas tienen empathy, right? Algunos nos desesperamos no. más que otras. <laughs> yes, thank you for sharing. Okay, what about the other ones? Oh, Marley, mm -hmm. tell me. Tolerance. Sorry? Tolerance. 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 Uh -huh. Honesty. Uh -huh. Respect. Oh, very good. What about the other ones? Another volunteer? Me, teacher. Yes, tell me, Miss Rebecca. What are the, the values? Responsibility. Ah, okay. Ah, that's a good one. Uh huh. Uh, em, empathy empathy yes and service to other service to others yeah very good let's see another one alguien más que quiera compartir los que usted recuerden que son los que ustedes ponen en práctica thank you Mr. Julio tell me después David ajá solidarity ah solidarity mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Efficiency. Ajá, efficiency. Ajá. Está, es que está efficiency y está eh, being efficient. Ok. Pe eficiente, ser eficiente y ser eficiente y tener eficiencia sería. That would be. Yeah. Ok. Porque no todos, <laughs> Yes. Another one, Mr. David. Teacher. Eh, eh, integrity. Ajá. Uh -huh. Intelligent. No, integrity. Ah, integrity. Yes, Mr. Thank you. What else? Excellence. Excellence. Yes, definitely. Excellence. Mm -hmm. mm. Only. <laughs> Only that. Well, that's perfect. Thank you, Mr. David. Ya mencionaron los otros de mi empresa. Sí, no, oh, no, pero para usted, Mr. Para usted, ¿cuáles son los valores que usted comparte con sus compañeros? Eso es lo que quiero saber. Porque no todos tenemos los, los de same values. No todos tenemos same value, como los mismos valores con nuestros compañeros. Algunos tenemos, unos somos respect, respectful, tenemos respeto con nosotros, pero otros no, ¿verdad? So, it depends, ¿ok? Pero lo que tú tienes con tus compañeros de trabajo, no es la compañía, ahorita no es la compañía, es mm -hmm. you, ¿ok? But very good, Mr. David, very good, thank you for sharing. Mm -hmm. Okay, now let's go with the next one. Okay, in here we have a conversation. Okay, in la próxima actividad tenemos una conversation, as you can see there. In this conversation, we are going to talk about the different values. Okay, and I want, quiero, vamos a ver, Dimas and Jenny's. Dimas, please, you are Mario and Jenny's are Teresa. Read the conversation. One, two, three, go. Okay. Did you receive a um, newsletter about the core value? ¿Cómo se dice? Values. 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 Of the company. I did. It is a great 
idea to remember which we are different from other companies. What do you mean? I mean, we now innovation, everything and respect should be part of our customer service. I see, you're fine. We will now about the value, values of the company, but maybe we don't apply them. Apply them. Apply them. Excellent. Exa exactly. We show like the va values that make you different from other companies. Very good. Thank you. Yes, right. Yeah. Remember, thank you in excellent Jennings and Dimas for helping me. So as you can see in this conversation, it's something true, right? It's algo verdadero. So we have to be different. Every, but every person has to be different with the values, right? Todas las personas debemos de ser diferentes en, en cuanto, bueno, tener algunos similares, pero diferentes valores en, en nuestra vida para poderlos aplicar, ya sea con nuestros compañeros o con el customer service, con el, los, el servicio, el cliente, ¿verdad? Because eso, porque así, este, pues, nos hace diferentes, ¿verdad? And from the companies, from companies, okay? And now, here we have a, a little bit of a conversation. Aquí, como pueden ver, tenemos uh, this uh, conversation. Um, so, we have, well, two questions, sorry. And it says, number one, what strategies does Teresa and Mario's company use to promote its core value? What do you think? According to the conversation, what they, do they use to, to promote the different values? Uh -huh. ¿Cuál creen que, de acuerdo con la conversación, dice que hay una, una estrategia que, ¿cuál estrategia Mario y Teresa, Mario, sí, Mario y Teresa, eh, utilizan para, para promover los values here? Uh -huh. Teacher, yeah. innovation. Esos son los values, ¿verdad? Esos son los values. Pero, ¿cuáles estrategias se utilizan para compartirlo? Para, para, no, no para compartirlo, para promoverlos. We know about the values. Newsletter. Mm, no. They live. Show, show the exactly. Values. Ahí. Show the part of our They, They eh, need the volume. Exactly. Ah. Eso se diferencia de cada compañía. It's very important, everybody. Some people say, ah, we are respectful, we help each other, we, we help others. Un montón de compañías tienen un montón de valores muy bonitos y se, se escucha súper bien, pero es diferente a, a tenerlos escritos ahí, a hacerlos, ¿verdad? <laughs> o a decirlos, ¿ok? It's very important to practice. Es muy importante practicarlos, right? Y eso es lo que les hace diferentes. Ahí dice, miren, we live. We should live the values, okay? So, viven los valores, okay? We should, well, live, they live the values. And number two, are Mario and Teresa positively impacted by the company's value? ¿Creen ustedes que ellos están eh, impactados? O sea, tienen impacto con los valores de la compañía? Yes. Yes, how? Como? Uh, How do you know? Trata, mm -hmm. este, um, <laughs> se olvidó como le iba a decir. Uh, but, uh -huh. uh, en inglés no, no puedo decirlo, pero sí, o sea, tratan la manera de... de They try de, to... Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Eh, They... No sé, como llevar una estrategia para poderlos okay. implementar. Ok. Mm -hmm. 
What about the other ones? What do you think? It says, are Mario and Teresa positively impacted by the company's value? <coughs> sure. Mm -hmm. Hay una parte donde dice, but maybe we don't apply apply them. them. Yes. Apply them. ¿Será que no lo están cumpliendo? No. no lo están aplicando. No, no, no. Aquí exactamente. Y eso es a lo que va a llegar. So, no. Ellos sí saben. They know about the values. Es lo que les decía. Eh, pueden saber mucho acerca de los values. Pero ellos en este caso dicen que no lo están aplicando. Y lo que dicen acá es que estrategia deben de cumplir. Es que deben de vivirlo. ¿verdad? Pero, o sea, entonces ahora bien. La pregunta es. Are they positively impacted? Pero dice que ya recibieron un correo. Entonces, ¿creen que vayan a cambiar ellos? So, yes, right. They are positively impacted. They are. ¿Y cómo sabemos que ellos están impactados positivamente por el correo? Porque dice that they are going, they should leave the values that make us different from other companies. Okay. Because they maybe they will change the values maybe uh, they will change no how to behave maybe they will change how to uh, behave right so tal vez esas personas pues van a cambiar su forma de comportarse de ahora en adelante van a ser Van a vivir los valores ¿vea? De, de la compañía donde ellos trabajan. It could be. Puede ser que eso suceda, right? We don't know. Because it says here, we should leave the values that make us different from other companies. Porque de acuerdo con lo que dice aquí, le dice ah, como que, hey, pero deberíamos de vivir estos valores, vea, para que nos veamos diferentes de otras compañías. Y le dice que los valores, ¿cuáles son los valores que ellos están pues supuestamente implementando. Innovation, efficient, mm -hmm. and respect. Exactly, very good. Now, let's move on. I don't know if you have questions so far. No. Okay. Now, here, this was the part that I was telling you. Esa era la, par la parte que les estaba comentando in exercise number five. And it says, complete the sentence below with one of the values from the box. Compare the answers with your partner. Okay, what do you have to do? You, everybody's going to write different answers for each of the sentences. Cada quien va a escribir, pues, una... Eh, un value, un valor para cada una de las oraciones. Como por ejemplo, eh, la uno dice, for example, I apply punctuality when I get to my job on time. Yo aplico, dice, puntualidad cuando, a, cuando llego a mi trabajo a, a la hora. Number two, mm, para mí, por ejemplo, for me, mi salvarado, when I welcome customers to the store, I show, I show respect, ¿ok? Pero ustedes pueden decir, I show loyalty. Or maybe you can say, I show efficiency. Por ejemplo, uh, I think, for me, right? The people that works in, in uh, Freon, okay? And Freon, they are very efficiency, okay? And then also for um, innovation, for example, Hugo, Hugo up, they are very innovative, okay? And so like that, but in this case, it would be for you, okay? That you're going to write one um, value for each one of the sentences. Ustedes van a escribir un valor para cada una de estas oraciones para ustedes, okay? So let's try to do it. Using this, utilizando las que están por ahí, like the... the the values from here. For this activity, I'm gonna give you five minutes, okay? So you can't uh, complete the answers, okay? So do we have any doubts so far? Alguna duda al momento? No, teacher. Okay, let's complete it, please. Vamos a completarlas ahorita, please. 
three minutes. Three minutes and so you can work and then we are going to compare with there, okay? Complete them with your ideas. Finish or not yet? Yes. yes. Okay, okay, perfect. Okay, yes. now, okay, very good, and thank you. What are we going to do right now? ¿Qué es lo que vamos a hacer ahora? So I'm gonna put you in pairs, okay? Lo voy a poner en parejas, and we are going to compare y vamos a comparar los values que tenemos, okay? And when we come back to the main one, I want you to tell me the difference, okay? Cuando regresemos a la principal, escuchen bien, vamos a decir las oraciones, ve ahí, vamos a comparar. Ah, oh, I have in number one, I show punctuality, okay? No, I show what it was the first one. I apply punctuality when I get oh, I get to my job on time, okay? Number one is punctuality. Digamos que para Mr. David era respect, okay? Entonces tenemos uno diferente. Y así vamos a ir a, a, anotando los values de mi, de mi compañero. Bueno, solo escuchando a nuestro compañero. Y después cuando regresemos a la principal, vamos a, a share. Algunos van a compartir qué fue lo que sus compañeros les dijeron. Questions right now? Okay. Questions? Teacher, yes. Pudiera colocar nuevamente la. Oh, la no problem. Para tomarle captura. Wow. Yes, I'm going to send it in, the, in WhatsApp too. Lo voy a mandar ahí en WhatsApp too. Okay. So you can have it. Yeah. Wait. Wait a second. Okay, I think, yeah. So you have it. Okay, so right now I'm gonna create the teams, okay? It will be in pairs, okay? In pareja vamos a estar. And you will have for this five minutes, okay? So you can share the sentences para que puedan compartir sus oraciones y respuestas, okay? Questions right now? Questions, doubt? Questions? No question. No. Okay, let's go. Work, please.
Miss Karen, Carmen, Ana Marleni. Ah, oh, wait, Miss Ana Marleni. Sí, es que cada vez no sé por qué que ustedes nos mandan los grupos a mí me saca de la aplicación. Da como dos días me está pasando eso, no sé por qué. Really? That's Tengo que volver a entrar. Sí, tal vez intenta ahorita incluirme en un grupo ahí a ver si. Ok, ok, ahorita me. Si puede, por favor. Ok, ahí vamos. Ah, pero sí. Ah, creo que sí. Ok. Ok, ahí va. Vamos a la teacher. Con, eh, con los valores de los cuadritos de arriba o cualquiera que nosotros consideremos. Eh, it would be with anything eh, that you, you, you consider the sentences, mister. Con lo que ah, usted, ajá, para okay, usted, okay. para usted, cual, ¿qué valores uh -huh. muestra al momento de, de esas oraciones? Ok. Ok. okay. Thank you. Okay, uh, when I finish my duties on time, uh, I show punctuality. Milton? Uh, also punctuality. Responsibility. Carmen? Carmen is oyente. It's okay. Not, por eso oh. se les envía. Ajá. So don't okay. worry. Ajá. Don't eh, worry. Okay. If I suggest a creative solution eh, to my team. Sí. La mía la había dejado yo siempre honesto, pero no. Honesto. Uh -huh. Como creo que no sería necesario que se parecieran, ¿va? pero. Pero que compartieran. Ajá. Ajá. Como para comparar, creo yo que sería. Sí. ¿Qué dice Cristian? Eh, no, pues. ¿Which one? ¿Cuál? ¿Cómo se llama? Estoy. No, no, no lo entiendo todavía, pero que le has estado agarrando copia. <laughs> Mister, no. Okay, but you have to complete with the correct word, right? Tenían que completar con la, con, bueno, con un valor, vea, este, las oraciones que se le estaba mostrando. Con los valores que aparecían ahí, y de hecho ahí se los acabo de mandar en el grupo Mister también, los cuales puede utilizar, no se preocupe. Okay. Mr. Christian, sí, sí, solo sí, deben de leer la oración y agregar la, el valor. Sí, como no puedo, ¿cómo se llama? Tener dos ventanas como estoy con el teléfono también. Oh. Es algo, ajá, el teléfono es algo, ¿verdad? Okay. Oh, ok, ok. So, uh, somebody can share. O alguien que pueda cambiar, compartir la pantalla para que el ministro ahí vea o no. No. Bueno, entonces que lo escuche, o que lo lean y que el ministro ahí también com complemente vea la oración entonces también. Bueno, bueno. Ok. En el 4 yo puse puntualidad. ¿Y ustedes? Eficiencia. 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 Lo voy a poner aquí. En el 5, yo puse But read, read the sentences, please. Just the answers, no. Practice. Ya, ya, practi ya practicamos, teacher. Ajá. Sí, ahorita solo, solo viendo que, que no, no pensamos igual, hemos tenido un diálogo filosófico. Sí. Oh, really? Innovation, punctuality, efficient. Uh, mm -hmm. uh -huh. Yeah, no, uh -huh. no, you have to speak in English, please, please. <laughs> so, solo terminamos de cuadrar, permítame. 
en, eh, yo Diana, yo... Vaya, en la okay. cuatro tengo aquí que Karen le puso este. No sé, Karen. Sí, en la cuatro, ¿verdad? Ajá. En sí, la en cinco... English, number five. <risa> must put number eh, innovation, ajá. Es que el inglés no se quiere salir de nuestra cabeza. El español. Ah, yes. <risa> No quiere entrar en inglés en la cosa. No, yes, sí, can't do it. Sí, lo puede hacer. He can't do it. Yeah. Bueno, number two, Karen y Dima. Sí. Ok. Mm, bueno, number... yo tomé nota, eh, tomé nota en mi cuaderno porque eh, ahorita tengo toda malosa una pantalla. Bye. Pero sí, así estábamos, ¿verdad? Sí, así estamos. Va. En común. Respect. En común. Actual, sí. Casi todas. La... Finish, Jenny's, and María, and Ana Marlene. Finish. Yes. Yes. yes, okay, yeah. perfect, okay. I'm gonna give you one more minute to one team, okay, and then we come back. Okay, let's wait a second for the other ones. Okay, wait a second. Thing. Almost everybody's here now. Let's wait a second. Okay, everybody, I think, just compare, right? Compare the, the values. Ahí todos están escuchando lo que son, comparing the values. But something very important, okay? Algo que quiero eh, recordarles. Please, please, we are going to try to speak more English. Vamos a intentar hablar más inglés, ¿ok? Aunque hablamos half English, has half Spanish, ¿ok? Aunque sea mitad español y mitad English. Pero no only Spanish, pero no solo español. We have to talk in English too, ¿ok? Because I know you can do it, ¿ok? Yo sé que ustedes pueden hacerlo. So, you got this, ¿ok? You have to try. Tenemos que intentarlo, ¿ok, everybody? Like right now, estaban diciendo puntualidad. ¿Y cómo se dice puntualidad en inglés? Everybody? Puntualidad. Yes, right. Si sí, lo saben decir en inglés. Y estaban diciendo puntualidad. No, no. Puntuality. Because you're right. No. Ok, vamos a ver. We are going to see who, how do we have it. Like, how was it comparing? Vamos a ver esas comparaciones. Let's go first with Ana, Verónica, Carlos, Miguel, and Nilton. Eh, also, Carmen, pero Carmen is oyente. Okay, Nilton, tell me the, the, the comparing, Nilton. I want to listen from you. What do your classmates say? ¿Qué dijeron tus compañeros? Tell me a little bit about it, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, um, the yeah. number two. La, la primera porque ya estaba hecha. ¿verdad? Yeah, okay. Number two, what did they say? ¿Qué dijeron? Um, Carlos is respect okay. and Ana uh, service to other. Mm -hmm. And number two, uh -huh. number three, number, number three, three uh -huh. uh, Carlos uh, responsibility and uh, Ana integrity. Nice. Number four, uh, Carlos punctuality. Mm -hmm. 
and Anna responsibly. And you? You didn't mention yours. I, <laughs> I, I punctuality. Punctuality, uh huh. Punctuality. Uh huh. Okay. And uh, number five, uh -huh. I, eh, no, Carlos, eh, innovation. Uh huh. Anna, innovation. Uh -huh. And I, innovation. Oh, perfect. Thank number, you, Mr. Uh -huh, number, okay, number, number six. six. Uh huh. Uh, Carlos serve to other uh -huh. and I serve to other and I serve to other. Uh, excellent. Oh, well, you're similar in that one. It sounds similar in that one. That's perfect. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you for sharing, Mr. Very, very good. Now let's go with the other one. Vamos a ver the next one. Next one. Help me, please. So we have Carlos, Christian, and Rodrigo. Help me, please. Mr. Carlos Arqueta, tell me. Tell me number one and number two only because I want to move on with another activity, please, mister. Tell me number one I, and number two. Uh -huh. Please tell me. Number one, efficiency. Mm -hmm. Respect. Yes, and? Responsibility. And you, and you, what do you say? So number one is punctuality, tenía yo, verdad? Pero you, what do you have? Efficiency. And the other ones? ¿Qué, qué tenía Cristian y Rodrigo? Efficiency. And number one, both. Number one, Okay, yes. and number two? Respect. Respect and, uh-huh, and? And responsibility. And you? Responsible for, similar, similar. Similar. Ah, yeah. understand, understand, understand. Thank you, mister. Very good. Okay. Let's see next one. Thank you for sharing your ideas, mister, too. Excellent. Let's go, Clelia, David, and Julio. Miss Clelia, I want to hear you, Miss Clelia. Quiero escuchar a Miss Clelia. Tell me number three and number four, please, miss. Pero read the sentences. Quiero que lean las oraciones. Ustedes solo los palios me están diciendo, I want to listen. I want to listen to you speaking in English. You did so, you do so good. Tell me, Clelia. Number three, um, Julio. Um, uh, okay. Ajá. Y yo. Yeah, yeah, that's okay. Um, tenemos... Um, we have and the number three, Julio tiene responsibility. Can you read the sentence, please? Podrías leer la oración, please, miss? Okay. Responsibility is to accept, accept your mistake and the consequence. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. Um, uh -huh. And David creo que tenía integrity. Integrity. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. Yes. Yeah. He says yes. 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 Okay. Number. Uh -huh. Number four. Yes. Uh, los tres teníamos eficiencia. Oh, perfect. Uh -huh. Thank you. Okay, and then can you read the sentence for number five, please? Number five, right? If if I, I no sé cómo se pronuncia subject. I'm sorry? Sociable. Yeah. Wait, if I suggest, ah, if I suggest if, a creative. If I suggest a creative solution to my team. Uh -huh. I, I apply, 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 I apply, apply innovation. Mm, very good. Who said that? Quien dijo eso? Uh, los tres. Oh, perfect. Three of you. Three, the team. Okay, perfect. Thank you, Miss. Excellent. Very, very good, too. Let's go. Wait a second. So let's go with next one. Dimas, Karen, and Merlin. I want to listen to Marlin. Sorry, Marlin, tell me. Oh, oh Dimas, do you want to try it, Mar uh, Dimas? Yes. Okay, tell me number five and number six, please, mister. Okay. Uh, the number five, if I suggest a creative solution to my team, mm -hmm. I have, I have apply. 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 <laughs> uh -huh. Don't apply. worry, don't worry. 
Ajá. Eh, eh, Karen. Eh, uh -huh. Integrity. Integrity, ajá. Uh -huh. Integrity. Uh -huh. eh, Oneida Innovation. Yes. En I Innovation. Perfect. Ok, y number six. Number six, uh, when I offer help to a customer, uh -huh. I demonstrate. Uh -huh. Demonstrate. Yeah, that's perfect. Perfect okay. pronunciation. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. um, Karen, mm -hmm. service to other. Uh -huh. um, Oneida, uh, me olvido cómo se pronuncia. Efic Efficiency. Efficiency. Perfect. And I service to other. Excellent. Wow. Thank you for sharing your ideas, Mr. Thank you. Thank you. Very good. Okay. Let's go now with Ana Marleni, Janice, and Maria Jamilet. I want to listen to Ana Marleni. Uh, oh, Maria Jamilet. Maria Jamilet, ¿ya puedes hablar, Maria? Sí, ya. Yeah. Okay, perfect. Okay, tell me number one and number two for your for you and your team, Miss and uh, Maria. Number one, number two, I no sé cómo dice, no las hicimos porque ya estaba oh. listo. Okay, what about and then number three, number four, yes or no? Yes. Okay, three, tell me. Four, five, six, and six. Okay, okay. <laughs> number three and four then, please. Read them and the answer, remember, okay? Okay, three and the values and, and two values. Okay. Empathy or integrity. Okay, perfect. Thank you. And to accept your mistake okay. and their consequence. Uh huh. Very good. And and for mm -hmm. I show efficiency mm -hmm. when I finish my duties on time. Yes. Everybody say the same answer? Todos dijeron la misma respuesta? Yes. Wow. <laughs> That's good then. Excellent. Thank you, Miss, for sharing. Very good job, everybody. Thank you for doing this activity. It's very important to practice, right? And the values were very good. And now we learned that. And now to finish with the values, okay, in the manual here on page 17, everybody, please go to page 17. Here we have uh, the, the values. As you can see, we have some definitions. And also we have uh, the words over here, right? And so number one, it says down and number one. Can you help me to read number one, please? The definition, uh, please, uh, Ana Marleni. Number one down. Y aquí está, pero me lo voy a hacer cerca. Lo voy a acercar, sorry. Here, help me to read number one, Miss Ana Marleni. Okay. Uh -huh. uh, begin faithful to your friends, family, principles, uh -huh. etc. 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 Et uh -huh. et What's the word, Miss? What do you think is the word? ¿Cuál crees que la palabra ahí? ¿Cuál es the value? Loyalty. 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 Lo Lo yal lo yalti. Yes, excellent. Very, very good. Just give me one second so I can fix this. Wait, le vamos a arreglar esto. Don't worry, okay? If I can. Oh, there. Lo yal. I know. Well, but yeah, it's loyalty. I don't know, porque no sé por qué se va hasta abajo, but yeah, it's loyalty. Vamos a utilizar mejor este, la herramienta de here the Zoom, porque esa no, it's true. Okay, thank you, Miss. Very good. Let's see, next one. Mr. Rodrigo, number two, down as well. Um, the belief that something or someone should not be harmed, uh -huh. treated rudely. Uh -huh. Very good. Okay, so what's the value, mister? Mm. Number two is here, down. Number two, okay. Mm. One, two, three. Estoy contando I... los cuadritos. <laughs> 
So I'm gonna read it in Spanish, Mister. The belief, el, la creencia that, oh, sí, la creencia that someone or something should be harm, should not be harmed or treated rudely, okay? La creencia de que algo o alguien no debería ser maltratado o, eh, o lastimado. ¿Cuál es esa, ese, ese value, mister? Mm -hmm. Yes. Respect. Yes, exactly. Respect. Somebody should be uh, like unrespectful, right? So it's respect. Awesome. Very, very good. Thank you, mister. Nada más que cuando me quedan como yo quiero. But it's respect. Y no, creo que la vamos a ocupar porque aquí no va a ser la A falta. Well, number three. Help me with number three, please. Rebecca. Down. Doing something well and effectively uh -huh. and without wasting time, money, or energy. Mm -hmm. What will be the word, Miss? Efficiency. Yes, wow, efficiency. Vamos a ver si nos sale acá. No, vamos a hacer con la otra tú, porque esta no. F, fish, no, double F. Fish, uh, uy, 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 fish, and C. Ok, very good. Thank you, Miss. Well, Mr. too, because you helped me to read. Solo que igual lo mismo. <laughs> I know, my goodness. It would be like this. No, but it's not efficiency, oh yes. What is missing? And efficiency. What is missing? And see, see, no, it's not efficiency. What is missing? Que falta en esa palabra. Efficiency, no parece correct. Está bien escrita, pero falta un S. F L I C I A M C I. Oh, yes. Aquí falta una C, bra. Yeah, yes. Okay, so it will be like this, right? Sí, es que yo sentía que faltaba una letra. Ahora sí. Efficiency. Now, yes, esta sí va aquí en medio. <laughs> okay, let's see next one. Let's see next one. It would be number five. Help me to read number five, please. Uh, Mr. David. Oh, no, num yeah, number five. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, number five. Yes. The introduction of new ideas, mm -hmm. methods, or invention. Innovation. Yes. Innovation. Yes, very good. And number five is over here. So tratar de hacerlo con esta, but I don't know. Eh, no, wait. No, they. No. Very, very good. Wow. Innovation. Oh my goodness, it has to be a little bit bigger because if no, no se va a ver, oh my goodness. Ahí está. Oh, that is what we are going to do then. So we can see it a little bit for the... There, oh my goodness, yes. I found the... And efficiency because now we have after we are going to find the other ones. Oh. There. Okay, then we are going to go with the next one. Okay, just let me fix this one. This is the last one.
okay in this one too. <laughs> Let me fix it because I don't want to be later with the. Teacher. Yeah. Uh, number three. Le hace falta. Number three. Una I. I see. Efficiency. Efficient. Sí. Where? I. Here. Sí. I. Sí. I. Yeah. Efficiency. Oh, yes. Thank you, Mr. Es que eso de escribir para abajo, it's hard for me because I don't identify. Exactly. Look, Mr. Is exactly the, the place. Very good. Thank you for letting me know. Okay, let's go with number seven. And the last one. Help me to read, please, Mr. Nilton. Mr. Nilton, are you there? Yeah. Okay, tell me. Okay, it is. Mm -hmm. Can you read the sentence, please, Mr. Number seven. Yes, please. Okay. Being honest and fair and behaving according to the moral principle that you believe in. Mm -hmm. So what do you think is the, the value? Number seven. Or anybody? What do you think? Integrity. Very good, Mr. Thank you. Just give me a second. Oh my goodness, it doesn't let me write over there because it's too big, this one. <laughs> yes, because I'm gonna be struggling in take three. Hey, excellent, thank you. Okay, next one, number four, across. And help me please, Christian. Mister, number four over there. Oh, Christian, okay, don't worry. Help me please, Julio, number four, over there, across. Being good at learning on group organization, mm -hmm. conflict, etc. I'm sorry? <clears throat> Leadership. Yes, very good. Leadership. Leadership. Oh my good. Leadership. Excellent, thank you. I know si es para el lado, oh my goodness. Wait a second. Yeah, it's it's from the across. I forgot about that one. Leadership. Okay, very good. Let's go next one. This is number four here. Number six. Help me to read, please, Mr. Limas. Thank you. Uh, the quality of, be, of being dependable, mm -hmm. the responsible, responsibility. Yes, very good. Dependable, right? Do you think that is the word, everybody, or no, it's not the word? Responsible. Lady or responsible. And no, it's exactly Mr. Very good. What about next one? Number eight. Tell me to read, please, Karen and Stefania. Number Number eight. I eight. Mm -hmm. The 
the ability the ability to under, understand yeah. how <coughs> some somehow feel because you can imagine what it is like to be them. Mm -hmm. What is that? Mm -hmm. Yes, very good. Empathy. Mm -hmm. Okay. So it, you don't know, right, what it's, what it's like for them. So it would be empathy. You put it in the other person's shoes. Te pones en los zapatos de las otras personas, right? So it's empathy. Thank you. And number nine, it's very easy, okay? Arriving, arriving or being done at exactly the time that has been arranged. What do you think is the word? Mm -hmm. Punctuality. Yes, very good. Punctuality. Okay. I know we are missing words here. Punctuality. Excellent, thank you. And number 10, help me to read number 10, please. Miss Madeline, thank you. Number 10, Miss Madeline, are you there? The quality of mm -hmm. being fine and truthful. Uh huh. What is that? What about the other ones? Do you remember? Mm -hmm. Honesty. Yes, very good, Miss. Honest. No, it's, ah, yes, it's honesty. honesty. Yes, honesty. Thank you. I it, It's missing some words, this one, too. Honesty. Oh my goodness, it's kind of hard to, to pose over here. <laughs> yes, es que me cuesta, oh my goodness. Este, por estar editando con eso. Pero the thing es que tenía una, un link en el cual ustedes las iban a escribir, pero se me borró. And sadly, porque quería que ustedes lo hicieran. That's why me costaba. I'm sorry. Mejor para nosotros. Era para bueno, ustedes, a ustedes les tocaba estar haciendo, yeah. Sí, porque era diferente, like the activity was a little bit different. It was not like this, no era esta, but anyways, we already did it. And you did an awesome job anyway, pero igual, muy bien. Do you remember all the values? Recordaron todos los values que estuvimos estudiando estos, eh, el día de ayer and today, and that was very good, okay? Thank you for doing it. Now, let's go ahead and continue. Now, we are going to do a little bit of a review. As you can see here, I have the, the link, but we couldn't do it. And now here, and it says that in this one, we are going to do um, a little bit of practice for the infinitives. Because as you remember, last class we were, well, on Mondays or uh, on Monday's class, we were uh, talking about infinitives, right? Do you remember what are the infinitives? ¿Se acuerdan cuáles eran los, eran los infinitives? Who remembers? Infinitives. Who remembers what is that? ¿Quién se acuerda que es infinitives? When I use to, for uh -huh. example, uh -huh. to room. Exactly. Very good. So, yes. Yeah. So, in this one, um, the infinitives is uh, when we use the, the preposition to plus a ver, right? And here uh, we are going to practice some uh, sentences, well, and questions as well, okay? And everybody's going to take turns so we can remember the topic. And so, vamos a uh, participar. Mr. David, what number? Choose, please. What number? David, what happened? I love it. Oh, microphone, I... microphone teacher, yeah. sorry. Okay, yeah. tell me. Uh huh. Yeah, seven. Okay, seven. Let's see the question. 
Okay, something they want to be when you were younger. Ah, algo que tú querías hacer cuando estabas younger, mister. Cuando estabas joven, mm -hmm. algo que tú querías hacer and, and you were not, y no fuiste. For example, I wanted to be a doctor when I was younger. I don't know why. And you? Uh, mm -hmm. I want to be a policeman. Really? Yes. Here in El Salvador, <laughs> <laughs> Why? Okay, thank you for sharing, yeah. Mister. Thank you. Good, good, good. Let's go now with Maria Jamile. Tell me one number, Miss. Tell me, tell me. Maria Jamile. Okay, um, what? Uh huh. Number. Ten. Ten. Okay, things that are important to do if you go for a job interview. Al, cosas que son importantes hacer en una entrevista de trabajo, Miss. What is something very important? Algo muy importante. Tell me, tell me. Ay. Estar seguro, ¿cómo se dice? Be secure. You have to be secured. Is you have security. You have to be. To have to be. You have to be. You have to be. Uh -huh, secure. Secure. Uh -huh, definitely right. You have to be secure about you. Very good, Miss. Thank you. Let's go. Next one. Choose a number, please. Jenny's. Um, number, number 15. 15, okay, miss. What do you want to do this weekend? What do you want? What do you want to do this weekend? Uh -huh. Like for example, me, I want to go to the beach. And you? I want to the park. Oh, you want to go to the park? Excellent. <laughs> Thank you, Miss. Let's go with, hmm. Uh, let's go. Christian, tell me one number, please. Uh, one. Okay, number one. A movie that's good to watch when you're feeling sad. <laughs> What is a movie, mister, that you should watch when you are feeling sad? Um, like for example, for me, I think I, it's good to watch, for example, um, let's see, Sing or Minions. Minions are funny, right? Eh, una película que sea buena o que puedas ver cuando te sientas triste, ¿ok? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. Entonces yo, I think it's... Uh -huh. eh, uh, minions. Okay. I want good uh, tread. <laughs> uh, trek. <laughs> okay. Yeah, trek yeah. is funny. Trek is funny. So definitely, right? To, to be sad. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> That's good. Uh, Carlos Arqueta, tell me one number. Number two. Two, okay. Something you think it's important to teach young children. Oh, very good. Algo que sea importante, algo que tú crees que sea importante de enseñarles a los a los chicos, a los niños, así, más, like, más chiquitos, like niños, obviously. Yeah, responsibility. Ah, okay. Honesty. So, it's important to teach. It's important to teach young children. Uh -huh. Honesty, uh -huh. responsibly, um, clean their room. Ah, to be clean, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
creer. Yes. To creer en, en Dios. To believe in God. To, to believe. believe God. Uh -huh. To believe. Yes. Mm -hmm. Thank you, mister. To believe in God. Okay. In God. Thank you. Thank you. Very good. Let's go. Next one. Uy, wait, wait. Eh, Carlos Miguel, tell me one number. Carlos Miguel, are you there, mister? Carlos Miguel. Yes. Okay, tell me one number, mister. Um, number three. Three, okay. Something you learned to do as a child, but you can't now. Algo que aprendiste a hacer cuando eras un niño, pero ahora no puedes. Like, for example, I learned to ride a bike and now I can't. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I felt. Um, nice on varias cosas. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Like, what? Uh -huh. I, I learned uh, to. Uh, bueno, mm -hmm. I can. I can. Uh -huh. Practice judo. Oh, really? So you learn to do judo? Yes. Nice. Thank you. Let's do Miss Clelia. Tell me one number, Miss. Um, number um, eight. Eight. Okay. Something you find difficult to do in English. Ah, oh, very good. Algo que encuentras difícil para hacer en inglés. So for example, for me, I find, I find difficult to, to write, write in English, okay? Es lo que, digamos, más me cuesta a mí. Like for me, it's English to watch, write, Essays, for example, para mí escribir un ensayo like 500 words en español y en inglés. I can't. I can't. It's too many words. It's demasiado para mí. So for you, okay? Uh, I find difficult to do in English um, grammatic. Ah, oh, to, to learn grammatic. Really? Grammatic. Oh yes. my God. Okay, Miss. Thank you for sharing. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay, now we are going to continue. That was a little bit of practice for the infinitives. Este es solo para un pequeño recordatorio recordatorio de los infinitives que recuerden que después vea de well we have to use the to plus a verb okay and but we have many more activities okay and let's go vamos a continuar and ah uh, before we continue antes de continuar let's do the attendance section vamos a hacer la sección de asistencia please say presente okay Adriana Adriana Gabriela Ana Marleni Presente. Thank you. Blanca Luz. Carlos Miguel. Present teacher. Thank you. Carlos Roberto. Present teacher. Thank you. Christian Alexander. Present teacher. Thank you. Eh, Clelia. Present. Thank you. Wait a second. Eh, David Emanuel. Present. Thank you. Diana Noemi. Edwin Roberto. Jenny Carolina. Present. Thank you. Jorge Luis. Jose Dimas. Present teacher. Thank you. Karen Estefanía. Me faltó ahí. Present. Thank you. Julio César. Present. Thank you. Nilton Alexander. Present. Thank you, Rodrigo Jose. Present teacher. Thank you, Ruth Rebecca. Present teacher. Thank you, Serafín. Maria Jamilet. Present. Thank you, Carmen Guadalupe. Present teacher. Thank you, 
Ana Verónica. Present. Thank you. Marlene Oneida. Present. Thank you. Juan Ezequiel. Okay, very good, everybody. Thank you for doing the practice with me. Let's go ahead and the practice, the attendance section, la sección de asistencia, tanta práctica, vea, se me queda la palabra practice. Okay, so now uh, we are going with the next activity. Eh, vamos con la siguiente actividad. In the next one, y esta otra actividad que les tengo preparada, it's to practice the um, Passive voice, okay. I know what did I do? Okay, hice. Oh my goodness. Es para practicar la uh, voz pasiva. And remember, passive voice, para la voz pasiva, what happens? Teníamos, recuerden, primero el objeto, ok? Just a reminder, un recordatorio. El objeto, después el verbo to be y después el verbo en pasado participio. Remember that it's very important to learn. Recuerden que es importante que los aprendamos, okay? So right now we are going to do this game that is called Guess the Object. Vamos a hacer esta actividad que es Adivina el Objeto, okay? It's what's the thing, guessing game. Okay, so we, here, here we have how to play. ¿Cuál es el objeto, okay? And you're going to read it. You say la van a ir leyendo. Okay, so hello. Yes, Mr. Julio. Mr. Julio. Help me, yes. Mr. Help me here, please, Mr. It's it is powered by electricity. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ayúdeme con todas las oraciones, please, there. Uh -huh. The outside is made of plastic. Ajá. Uh -huh. It's put on the wall. Uh -huh. It is used a lot of in the summer. Uh -huh. it, it is used to make the room hotter or colder. Uh -huh. What is the object, everybody? What do you think? ¿Qué creen que es el objeto? Look, it's powered by electricity. Okay. It's made of plastic. You put it on the wall. It is used when it's in the summer. Cuando estamos en el summer, cuando está hot, lo utilizamos. Y you can make it hotter or colder. What is it? Okay. Air conditioner. Yes, very good. It's air conditioner. Perfect. Okay. Thank you, Mr. Julio. Let's go. Next, up, next object. Help me to read, please. Marlene. Miss Marlene, help me here, please. It is. I know. Uh -huh. Yes, yes, continue, Miss. More than activity uh -huh. of city. Uh -huh. More money is made? Made for this is ten from movies uh -huh. loss of time is waste waste doing he this uh-huh it is money mainly mainly playing played uh-huh by by teener boys uh -huh. by boys okay so what is the object, everybody? Video games. <laughs> you saw the answer. Yes, it's video games or computer games. Ahí está. Thank you. Okay, let's see next object. Help me to read this object, please. Uh, volunteers. Quiero que ustedes participen, please. Recuerden que es muy importante en speaking, speaking. So, volunteers, to help me. Me, teacher. Thank you, Ana Marleni. Let's go. It is made from very many leads. Uh -huh. It is leads. so leads. Mm -hmm. It is so in electronics shop shops. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. It is was launched quite a long time ago. About hasn't became become uh -huh. so popular. Uh -huh. Out of a space is needed to have it in your house. Uh -huh. What is this object? Okay. It's with lights. Let's, recuerden que son las luces, ¿verdad? Let's, okay. 
So, fue lanzado hace mucho tiempo, dice, pero no se ha, no se ha hecho tan popular. Se ocupa mucho espacio para tenerlo en la casa. Hmm. And it's sold by many electronic shops. Y lo venden muchas tiendas electrónicas. What do you think it is? Any ideas? ¿Alguna idea? What is it? What is the object? Hmm? TV. TV. Yes. Hmm. Let's see. Ah, here's another one. Blu-ray videos are best watch on these. Los videos. Ah? The screen. Blu-ray player. Ah. Uh, no. <laughs> It's a television, HD television, high definition television, but almost, uh, right? You, you say television, right? So it's almost the same. It's casi lo mismo, right? Television. But in this one, it's HD television. So high definition, como alta definición, televisores de alta definición. O sea, you can see every grano, every, everything. Estaba <laughs> difícil, teacher. No, it was simple. <laughs> Por lo de HD. <laughs> Yeah, that was the only one. Volunteer to help me. Volunteers. Hi, teacher. Thank you. Let's go, Mr. David. Wait, ahí va. Okay, so this one. It is used almost every day. Uh -huh. It is usually made of plastic. Uh -huh. Numbers are seen on this. Uh -huh. I said by this in a song. Or tune is turned, turned, turned. Uh -huh. On when the time comes. Uh -huh. What do you think it is, everybody? Radio, radio. Uh -huh. Radio or? Watch. Watch. Clock. Uh, okay, clock. Yes, alarm or clock. Very good. <laughs> Excellent. Let's do another one. Volunteer, please to help me with this one. Me sure. Thank you. Let's go. It was invented a long time ago. Uh -huh. It is powered by electricity. Uh -huh. Some are made by Toshiba. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. It is controlled by buttons on the wall. Uh -huh. So? Um, I don't know. <laughs> what about the other ones? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> uh -huh. um, no. <laughs> no. TV again. People Durable. are carried up and the down in it. Doorbell. Uh -huh. I'm sorry. sorry. Doorbell. Doorbell. No. The timbre. No. 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 Doorbell. No. Ah, comp computer. Computer? No. no. Elevator. Ah, elevator. <laughs> Al decirlo iba, teacher. Ah, elevator or lift. En, en UK, en el Reino Unido, se dice lift. Y en Estados Unidos o, o United States, elevator. Okay, difference, okay? But very good. Si Tochiva, they invented them, ¿ok? Y sí, vea, tiene los botones en la pared. Eh, dice que suben a las personas y bajan, ¿ok? So, it was the elevator. But good try, though. You did an awesome job. Thank you. And let's go ahead and continue. Let's see. Wait a second. One second, please. And now let's go for the book, okay? In book, manual, okay? Let's go into manual because in there we have a little bit of practice for this one more time. Eh, vamos a ir al manual porque tenemos un poquito de práctica there. And it says number two over there. It says that we have to correct the mistake for the infinitives. Number one, the company's mission is to distributing top quality office supplies. What is the mistake over there, everybody? Distributing ing exactly, so it will be two to, to, to dis distribute, yes, to distribute. Okay, distribute like that. Okay, 
Number two, our vision is it to become the leaders in the telecommunication sector. What is the correct answer? Mm -hmm. Our vision it, is to. Aha, uh -huh. it no it no it. Aha, uh -huh. it is. It's. Exactly. Thank you, Miss. Very good. Vamos a ir poniendo aquí un también un, un X to the words, right? Y aquí es distributing, right? Okay. Number three, we exist for to provide integrated logistics service. What is the mistake? For two. Exactly. What would be? So it would be. Exist to provide, right? No tenemos que poner for and to, right? Number four, our goal is be organized as the number one diary product. Is organized. Is. No. Is to be. Ajá. Uh -huh. is. is to is. be, exactly, is to be. Nos faltaba el to ahí, ¿verdad? Para to make uh -huh. it. Porque recuerden que estamos hablando del infinitive, entonces quiere decir que nos faltaba el to, right? Number five, Rex envisions to becoming the number one manufacturer of clothes for babies. For kids, sorry, for babies. What? <laughs> no, uh huh. Becoming, tiene que ser become. Exactly, to become. Perfect, thank you. So this one is now. And this one is I guess. Excellent. Question so far about infinitives. Okay. Next one, exercise number three. In here, we have the ING uh, forms after prepositions that in fact, yesterday and today, some of you were sending me sentences. And I want you to help me with the sentences. Aquí pues tenemos estas palabras y como les explicaba, vea, y algunos les mandé ahí las correcciones, ¿verdad? Que cuando teníamos acá, aquí tenemos esta frase, be in charge of. Cuando dice el be, eh, en nuestra mente vamos a pensar, ¿ok? Que es el am, el is o el are, ¿verdad? Que debemos de utilizar. Porque algunas, algunos de ustedes me estaban utilizando el be así, sin, sin pues, conjugarlo. Y debemos de conjugarlo con cualquiera de estos tres, ¿verdad? Entonces, por ejemplo, esto podría haber sido be in charge of. It's like, ah, and you have to talk about the responsibilities of your work, right? For example, I am in charge of teaching, okay, for me. What about you? Tell me, Carlos Argueta, number two, committed to. Committed to is comprometido, right? I am. Uh -huh. en, con tu com, empresa, recuerda, committed to, to what? To work, <laughs> to working, good, let's say, okay? Thank you, let's go, next one. Dedicated, Mr. Rodrigo, tell me. I am mm -hmm. dedicated mm -hmm. to? Um, to learning English. Ah, nice, thank you, Mr. Learning English. No se produce en el but very good. Let's go. Next one. A girl, Miss Jenny is responsible. Miss Jenny. For class English. For, uh, for being? For, or for having, for having, let's say, for having English class. English class. So, sería, I am, repite, I am. Is responsibility. 
No, no, sería así mismo. I am responsible for... Uy, uy. Ajá. Uh -huh. I am responsible for... For having English class. I English class. For having English class. And so, yes, thank you. Let's go. Dimas, number, the last one, be accountable to. Four, sorry. Four. Mm -hmm. Be accountable for. I am accountable, accountable for my. Remember a verb with ing? Sí, sí, ing. Ajá, yes, yes. A contable is in Spanish, teacher. Eh, like. Mm, like it would be like a contable like the one como la persona que estás a cargo de oh, okay accountable for o responsable de mm -hmm. boss for boss for reporting, 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 reporting to the boss. Boss. <laughs> oh my goodness, mister. It's Friday, right? But it's Friday. <laughs> no, miss. Es que recuerden que después de, de todas estas palabritas, solo era un recordatorio, vea acá, vea. Porque después de esas palabritas utilizamos ING. Y yo sé sí. que es un poco difícil de recordar, vea, estar ahí como recordando, ay, tengo que utilizar ING, no. Pero por eso es que, si se fijan, trato de hacerles, eh, pues, algunas ahí actividades que pueden incluir lo que estábamos, vea, estudiando. Entonces, después de estas palabras, yo lo único que quería es que utilizaban el, el, uh, ajá. And that was basically, but you did good. Thank you for giving your ideas, everybody. Thank you, thank you. And okay, and now here we are going to do this activity. Wait, we're not going to do that one. Because I have, um, no, we're not going to do this one because it's already time. It's, it's, it's 10, <laughs> the time is so fast. But wait a second. Before we no, because we are missing the the little one part of the homework. Platform. Uh -huh, the platform. Right now we are going to do that. Vamos a hacer la platform right now. Don't worry. Everybody go to the platform. Todos por favor vayan a la platform so we can work over there para que podamos trabajar en eso, please. And then when you finish the platform, we can go. Yes, see, cuando terminemos la platform, we you can go and yeah. Let's go to exercise number five, right? Vamos con exercise number five. Are you there now? Estamos todos ahí ya. Number one. Number one. Carlos Miguel, help me. Read the uh, we use the passive when we don't want or need to specify who did the action. True or false? It's true. Thank you. Let's go. We use the passive when we don't want to need. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Excellent. Let's go. Next one. Uh, volunteers. Thank you. We use the verb being the participle to form the passive. Mm -hmm. uh, true. True. Thank you. Very good. David, I love you, Mr. Tell me. Mm -hmm. uh, you can omit who did the action when you're using the passive. Uh -huh. True or false? Mm. Puedes omitir. True. Okay. Thank you. Number four, volunteer, number four. True. Can you read it, please, Mr. Rodrigo? Okay. <laughs> please, please. Uh -huh. 
Yo sé que es you Friday, can... but you can do it. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> ya me duele la espalda. <laughs> no. Me... Uh -huh. You can mention the door. Doer. Door door? Of the action by adding by. Uh -huh. True. True. Hmm. Thank you. And number five. Hey, teacher. Thank you, Mr. Timas. Uh, the door. Doer. Door. Doer. 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 Uh, mm -hmm. The door is more important than the action. Uh -huh. True or false? It's false. Okay, let's go, send, let's see. Wow, 20 points, one more time, everybody. Awesome. So here we have the answers. That was super good. So, uh, so you can take a screenshot or whatever so we can practice and do the platform for today. Remember that we have the section there, okay? So finish it by today. Right now you should have finished this section. Ya pues ojalá la hayan terminado en este momento. Okay, so there we have it, okay? And yes. And please, something to remind you. Wait, me puedo, puedo moverme ya? Can I take it off? Sí. Yes. Yeah, okay. Yes. Okay. Yes. okay. Algo que quiero aclarar y quiero recordarles y hacerles conciencia. Yo trato de yo trato de que todos todos acá participen, si se dan cuenta, ¿verdad? Pero quiero que también de ustedes salga y digan, "Mi miss, okay, I want to participate." ¿Por qué? Because English, okay, in every every new ability, okay? Todas las nuevas habilidades, porque inglés es una habilidad, I think, okay? Todo se trata de práctica. Y si usted quiere aprenderlo, ¿ok? Y quiere ponerlo en práctica, ¿qué más que acá? ¿Ok? Así que vamos a intentar de cuando oh, estemos en la clase y hay una actividad, decir, yo voy a participar. Levanten la manito, me digan, mi, 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 yo aguanto, participe, ¿ok? Porque yo trato de llamarlos a todos, pero a veces se me va, se me escapa uno, a veces participan unos más que otros. Aquí, así que, Please, everybody, okay? Eso tiene que ser una competencia, please, okay? So you can learn very well English, okay? Questions, doubts, comments, alguna pregunta, duda? Karen, don't sleep. <laughs> questions? No questions. Okay. Eh, para, este, para este día, solamente hay que tener finalizado la unidad. Uno como section mínimo. one, yes, solo la okay. section number one. Sí, la otra okay. semana tenemos sección número dos y el examen midterm, el examen de, sería como la actividad número dos, ok. Entonces lo que vamos a hacer es que durante la semana vamos a ir haciendo la sección número dos y ustedes deben de hacer solos el midterm, ok, tienen que intentarlo. Porque no, no creo que nos quede tiempo para hacer las dos, las dos secciones, ¿ok? Entonces, tiene, yo le voy a ayudar con la section number two y ustedes hacen el meter. ¿Yes? Ok. So, any other question? ¿Alguna otra duda? No, pues. Rodrigo, yo creo que sí, Mr. Rodrigo. Eh, sí, no, lo que dijo usted del midterm, ¿qué, ¿qué es, teacher? No recuerdo bien. El midterm es como el, es una actividad, se lo voy a mostrar, porque aquí ahí la tienen ya. Okay. En el Mister es como un pequeño examen de todo lo que han estudiado de la sección 1 y la sección 2. De la semana, es que vaya, cada semana para nosotros es por secciones, ¿verdad? Entonces, uh -huh. la sección, aquí le vamos a vaya, la sección 1, pues aquí está, vea, la terminamos, ¿verdad? La uh -huh. sección 2 la vamos a ir haciendo. Y la sección de midterm es como los temas que van a estudiar en la sección, los que ya estudiamos en la 1 y los que van a estudiar en la sección número 2. Es de las dos cosas. Así, miren, ya lo voy, aquí está el midterm, que es el... Ay, aquí está. Y tiene solo secciones de examen. Está sección 1, 2, 3 y 4. Y eso es todo, puro examen, ¿ok? Ah, ok. Pero... Ese ya aparece al final de la sección 2. Exactly. Al final okay. de sección 2. Eso ya lo tienen que tener. Si quieren, pueden ir avanzando. ¿Por qué? Porque esta sección de la que de esta semana que viene es temas que ustedes ya vieron, que es el simple present. Entonces pueden ir avanzando si ustedes gustan y si no pueden o no saben qué hacer en algún exa, en alguna ejercicio, 
Escríbanme, no tengan pena, ok. Sábado, I mean, Saturday or Sunday. You can write, ok. You can ask me. Solo que si me tardo, ahí mis disculpas. Eh, pero siempre chequeo. Por ejemplo, te acabo de chequear las oraciones de Mr. Carlos, de mi. No me acuerdo quién fue la otra mis que me escribió. Entonces, eh, don't worry, you can ask me. Me mandan la foto de lo que no entiendan y yo les ayudo con gusto, ok. Don't be uh, shy, ok. I want to help you, but try to do it. Try to learn. And the verbs. Y los verbos. Otros cinco verbos on Monday. Voy a, así esporádicos. Les voy a estar preguntando, ¿ok? So continue with the verbs. Continuamos con los verbos, ¿ok? Ok. Ok. Bye-bye, everybody. Have a great weekend. And see you Monday. Bye -bye. Los veo el lunes. Bye-bye. Take care. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Okay. Bye. 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 Good night. Bye. 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 Good night, everybody.